This post contains spoilers for Dark Crisis on Infinite Earths No. 4 Despite other heroes' attempts to lead during Dark Crisis on Infinite Earths, Dick Grayson's Nightwing is the only hero woes truly qualified to lead a new Justice League. With the world falling into chaos after the apparent loss of the Justice League and the rise of Deathstrike's army of supervillains, a new team has struggled to form as the Justice Society of America continues to do what it can to keep things handled in the DC Universe. However, Alan Scott tells Dick Grayson exactly why he needs to be the one to step up and take charge. In previous issues of Dark Crisis on Infinite Earths from writer Joshua Williamson and artist Daniel Sampier, John Kent's Superman gathered a collection of new heroes, hoping to create a new league to replace the original team that was seemingly killed at the hands of Pariah. However, Black Adam made it quite clear that John was not ready to lead. That being said, none of the gathered heroes were willing to listen to Black Adam either, refusing to go along with his brutal and lethal strategies for dealing with Slade Wilson's villains. While Nightwing seemed like a no-brainer to lead a new league, Slade's attack on Titan's Tower, where he nearly murdered Beast Boy shook the first Robin to his core. Thankfully, Nightwing receives a much-needed wake-up call from Alan Scott's Green Lantern and Dark Crisis on Infinite Earths No. 4, one of the Justice Society's most senior members. Despite Dick Grayson feeling as though Hess failed everyone he cares about, Green Lantern confirms the world has its eyes on Nightwing with several heroes still looking up to him and ready to follow his lead. While there are plenty of heroes who might be able to get by and lead the next generation of heroes, Alan Scott makes the great point that what the world really needs right now is DC's first legacy hero to lead the way. When Batman seemingly died at the hands of Darkseid, it was Dick Grayson who put on the cape and cowl, determined to not let the Dark Knight's legacy die out. Even with Bruce Wayne returned, Grayson continued the legacy of Batman by taking what Bruce had taught him and applying it in his own city of Bloodhaven as Nightwing. Being the first hero to ever do something like that, it makes sense why several heroes are looking to Dick to help them figure out how to do the same in the original League's absence. Thanks to Alan Scott, Nightwing is finally ready to take charge and lead the way helping his fellow heroes keep the world safe as they work to keep the Justice League's legacy alive. While Pariah may have brought back a new version of Infinite Earths by the issue's end and Deathstrike has set his sights on annihilating the Legion of Doom, the heroes of the world are far from defeated now that Nightwing is ready to lead and inspire as one of DC's greatest and first legacy heroes. Dark Crisis on Infinite Earths No. 4 is on sale now.